Hi, I'm Gilbert Ford, author and illustrator of The Marvelous Thing That Came From the Spring, a picture book about the story of the inventor of the slinky. The thing that makes this picture book different from my others is that it was illustrated entirely in dioramas. Before I started writing and illustrating books for kids, I designed and illustrated educational toys. I drew everything on the computer and then had it printed and die cut so that it could later be assembled into 3D objects by the children. When I began the marvelous thing that came from a spring, I used the same technique I had learned while designing the toys for this book. After the sketch was approved, I had to figure out how to transform a 2D illustration into a 3D diorama. First, I designed the houses in Adobe Illustrator that would be printed, cut out, and later assembled. After I designed the three houses and their folds, I exported the files to Photoshop and added the line work. Then I printed it from my Canon printer. Then I sprayed the print and mounted it onto bristle board so that it would be strong enough to stand upright. Then I cut out the print with an X-Acto knife. Then I scored the flaps so that they would be easy to glue down by pressing lightly with the X-Acto knife. After it was scored, I folded the creases until it fit the shape of the building and glued it down with a glue stick. I found some washcloths that reminded me a little bit of grass, and I decided to incorporate that in the neighborhood. What I wanted to do was use everyday objects in the artwork that could ground the reader so they understand the scale of the artwork, but also show them a different way of using a material. When I wasn't drawing, I would go to flea markets looking for old vintage toys. When I found these two cars, I knew they'd be perfect for the illustration I'm working on. Once I made a setup, I added the old cars and then I had it photographed. Later, I took the photo in the Photoshop and added in the background. For anything that was too difficult to cut out for the model, I reserved it for last for drawing on the Wacom tablet in Photoshop. This is how the image printed for the marvelous thing that came from a spring. <laughs>